Okay. Um. Shouldn't I like tell someone to call an ambulance? No. Pritchard, I located Radford. He was attacked by men in suits. Private security, Secret Service types. I'm going after them. What about Radford? Did you get anything out of him? He's in pretty bad shape. You need to call it in, get an ambulance to his apartment stat. Got it. And Jensen, don't get yourself killed, okay? Oh, Francis. I didn't know you cared. Don't flatter yourself. I care about the security of this company. You getting yourself killed compromises that. So don't be stupid. <laughs> Thanks, Pritchard. You're too kind. What is this? I don't know how I know all this, <laughs> but I'll take it. Let's see, trank darts. What's this? Sniper rifle ammo. I don't have a sniper rifle. Ooh. Yes! Finally! Some combat rifle ammo. Should I throw a box at someone and kill them? <laughs> like that person right there that I killed earlier with a barrel. Nobody seems to care about. Okay, where am I going here? Okay, so there's one right over here. Apparently. I know, right over here is a relative term, but... Okay. Never mind. I'm going this way. Okay, we are going this way. <coughs> Come on. Pick up the barrel. Pick, pick, pick up. Thank you. There we go. Unstop him! Ah! I heard that. Come out. I'm supposed to go for this quest. What was that? Pocket secretary. I should probably read that. Pocretary. Ah. Uh. Okay. Four, not seven, but four. Open. Ebook. Fire destroys White Helix Labs. Twisted Cedar, Michigan. Uh, firefighters are called to White Helix Labs. Find an early morning place. By the time they arrive, the main building was already engulfed in flames. General Manager Michael Barris could not be reached for the comment, but a pre-recorded message had been left on White. Helix Labs toll free line stating that nobody is believed to have been hurt in the fire. The message was later removed and they begin pulling bodies from the wreckage. The recovery operation is ongoing, but he also stated that the circumstances behind the blaze are very suspicious. Um, is a bio research firm studying childhood genetic diseases. Interesting. And what are these? I'd look at them. Yes, these. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> A collection of pictures from your childhood. 
That's weird. Access granted. Okay. <coughs> okay, is this Saw that one. Uh, I gleamed off the PC of your man's bow or its bow. Hey Megan, I know you had some questions about the files I sent. Sorry about the graphs. But the sample was running short of groundbreaking and I got excited. I don't suppose you could tell me where you got it. The DNA samples are remarkable, luckily. The sample you sent fits one of our evolutionary models of the future. We're talking about someone who's ahead of the genetic curve by one step, maybe two. Do you know what this could mean for medicine alone? You have a living, breathing Nobel Prize on your hand. Thing is, I can't tell if this is natural or something done to the mother while the baby was in vitro. But I know that this mother's, this person's mother had no such mutations. Interesting. And then we saw that one. Mm, white helix labs. Okay, and I think this is the one we read earlier. Hmm. So, like, if you hadn't won that conversation with your boss, you could read it here, apparently. Wait, what am I supposed to do here? There's something else I need to do? What the heck? the ebook. Hello, game. There's something else here, apparently. Ah. Okay. What? Come on, get out of here. I'm busy. Okay, I read the book, picked up the oh. pictures, and the emails. No? Something else that I'm missing? Oh, apparently there's five emails in here. <laughs> you have to move this lighter. Okay. After playing the entire game where nobody could have more than four... They've had more than four this whole time, haven't they? I've missed, like, tons of emails. Oh my gosh. Whatever. There's a woman named blah blah blah. She was a nurse and friends with the Jensen. She's living in Detroit and Blurkin Court. She's senile! Maybe you could coax some information from her, winky face. Sounds like fun! I'll get right on it. Come here, you. Hey, I said. I 
didn't need that at all. Awesome. Okay. So, these apartments here? Like, really? Hmm. I've probably been in these apartments like a billion times now. <laughs> Especially searching for stupid. I don't carry more than. Oh! Stay away! Gosh darn it. I killed another person. <laughs> wow. Good job. Wait, what? What? Okay, going the wrong way. So there's that. I'm sorry I didn't mean to. Stay away. Hmm. Maybe Leave I think alone. I need to go. <laughs> you guys saw nothing. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> oh well. What the heck? Am I blind or something? There's a staircase there. Gosh darn it. Do 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 Please, please don't kill me. Like what here? Which I can't use because the door doesn't open? Is that is that what you're telling me? Okay, I'm going up here. <laughs> I don't even know. Please, please don't kill me. Not sorry. I will try not to kill you this time. <laughs> Maybe. Alrighty then. That's Gangbanger's place. It's where what's his face is. That's a wall I can punch through if I wanted to waste my energy. That's the other way out. We're in, whatever. Take a look. I'm a friend of Greg Thorpe. Really? Okay, I give you the egghead discount. If you already remember me, since I've been here like a billion times now. Rate of fire upgrade. Sure. Rocket stun. Hell yeah, I'll take all your ammo. See ya. Sick, yeah. Okay, that's not where I meant to go, but we'll take it. <laughs> okay, I'm just playing confused now. I can't freaking get to the. I've told you lately that I'm super confused. I don't know where I'm going. There's stairs there. Hmm. 
There's two sets of stairs. The freak. Okay. So it's over there. Um, was I trying to get to the wrong? Totally wasn't trying to get in the wrong building for the past. I don't know, 15 minutes or so? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> I mean, uh, what? I mean, what? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Let's try this, shall we? Is this her? Michelle Walther. Did yes. I leave my door open? Wait. You're not from Rolling Mills. You're too handsome to be from Rolling Mills. No, I'm not. <laughs> Mrs. Michelle Walters, is it? My name's Adam Jensen. <laughs> no, no. You much too old to be him. You must be from Rolling Mills. And please, it's Miss Walters. Brent Radford sent me. Do you remember him? He's a detective. Yes, lovely gentleman. He still has my photos of Adam when he was a baby. Oh, could you be a dear and fetch them for me? I forgot who has them, though. Um, Are these the photographs? These oh, yes, yes. Thank you. I, I haven't seen Adam Jensen in such a long time. Forever, it seems. Such a happy baby. Um. Miss Walters, can you tell me about the boy in those photos? The boy in those photos? Adam. Tragic, really, what happened to his parents. His real parents. His real parents? They died in that fire. Horrible, really. I was there. At least those other cribs were empty. I only had to save Adam. Mrs. Walters, I really need you to focus. What are you talking about? Why, I already told that nice detective all this already. About the experiments and the fire at White Helix Labs. We knew Adam was special. That's why his parents started the fire. So they what? didn't do the same thing to the next batch of babies. Oh. So my Adam's real parents were trying to protect him. But from what? Why, from the conspiracy, of course. But I've said too much. Would you be a dear now and go fetch my dinner? Did it say Omega? Look, Miss Walters, I need to know about Adam Jensen, and I don't have all day to sit around with you, so what can you tell me about him? Oh, no. I could never betray his confidence that way. Why, Adam has been through enough. Miss Walters, am, please. Adam. This is important. What can you tell me about Adam? My memory isn't what it once was, you know, but I saved Adam. Saved him? From the fire at White Helix Labs. What was he doing there? Oh, I can't say. I'm not sure I even remember. Please, anything will help. I really couldn't say. But his parents loved him. Enough to start the fire. Enough to give him to me so I made sure he got a good family. Enough to make sure nobody experimented on him again. What do you mean, experimented? Miss Walters, what experiments were they doing? I'm sorry. What were we talking about? Oh, when are them Rolling Mills people gonna get here with my dinner? 
Miss Walters, please. I know it was a while ago, and remembering all the details might be hard, but do you think you can try and focus for a minute? What did you tell the detective? Well, Mr. Radford and I spoke about many, many <laughs> The wheels on the bus go round and round. But don't you have meals to <laughs> Round and round. And where is my dinner? Okay. Thank you for your time, Miss Walters. Oh, before I forget, if you see Adam, could you please give him this? It's for all the birthdays and Christmases I've missed. I've been saving them. Okay. Oh. Make sure he gets it. Thank you, dear. Why, he must be 12 or 13 by now. Make <laughs> sure he gets something nice. Okay. Pritchard, I need you to assign a temporary security detail to an apartment on Brooklyn Court until I can figure out a more permanent solution. The woman's name is Walters, Michelle Walters. Security detail? What the hell, Jensen? Who is this woman? She's... family. But she's vulnerable. I'll explain later. Just do this for me, please. And not a word to Seraph. Can I trust you on this, Pritchard? Christ, Jensen. All right, all right. I'll do it. But there better be a damn good reason for this. There is. I'll fill you in next time I see you. But right now I need to get back to work. And Pritchard, thanks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Um. Do I have to go through the freak? Oh. Ooh. Achievement! I'll try not to kill anybody this time. Uh, which way do I need to go? Uh. So does that mean Jensen's parents could still be alive? Like, did they die in the fire? Or did they make it look like they died in the fire? Wait, what? The heck? I'm so confused. Okay. I mean, they probably are, but Sorry, I'm just but guessing. and stripped me of my purse. Were there any witnesses? Yeah, but they refused to stick around to wait for you guys. They were scared for their safety. Maybe if you had come sooner. I'm sorry, ma'am, but most of the squad has been assigned to subdue the rioters. It seems like all I'm hearing from... Wine, wine, wine. Is there one this way? No. There's this one, and then there's the... the... underneath. So... Police these days are sorry. Have anything else to report, ma'am? No, thank you. I'm fine. I'm gonna wait for my sister to come. <laughs> Goodness. Some people. Jeez. Alright. Shazam! I love how it's like, search these areas by going to this exact spot on the map. But not this spot, because that's returned. Oh, bless you. <laughs> hey, guys. Embarrassing, really. Like anyone can walk into the precinct and take whatever they want. I know. What if this wasn't the first time? Some gang leader out here could have profiles of every cop on the force. They may even know where we live. As long as the media doesn't get involved in this. If they do, we're gonna get reamed in public by the mayor. You know how much the commission loves that. We already got the feds in there, looking at us and shaking their heads like we're a bunch of naughty children. Where did that cigarette come from? It just like appeared out of nowhere. Hmm. Down we go. I didn't even think about that. The poor police. But I am horrible at sneaking, guys. I'm sorry. But it was not... It was not about to go through and kill everyone. 
I'm horrible at sneaking, so I don't want a shotgun. Pocket secretary. Yes. I hear beeping. It doesn't... does not bode well. Sergeant Mitchell. What? Whoa! Whoa! Interesting. We pay you to move stuff around, not give your opinion. Oh. So if I had actually... Oh! Okay. Bothered to go down here before going to the police station, I would have had all their passwords. Somebody does not want me down here, I'll tell you that much. Ooh. You saw nothing. Who's there? Boom! Holy crap, I killed him. Wow, that that's awesome. Oh. <laughs> ah, best way to decommission them yet. Rise up! The state's grip may be tightening, but it can't choke everyone. Blah, blah, blah. Join me and help strike a blow against the government and their neo-fascist foot soldiers. Together we can reshape this once great nation. Right. Uh, don't stand in the water. However... <laughs> Holy frick! I wasn't expecting it to explode, per se. How do I get over there? Oh. Going the wrong way. Well, that makes sense. Okay. have a chance, bomb. Okay, that was the wrong button. Access granted. Boop. Ooh, Praxi. Oh, they're like, you ain't getting in here no more. Turn off that stupid electricity. Right. Um. Let's get out of this. This uh, sewer. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Me good with English. Could I shake the camera more? What's this? Ah, whiskey. Okay, so I probably need to go all the way. Ooh, I can stop by the limb clinic on the way. Go! And action! Da -da -da. 